This spring, thousands of young people across the province will enter the next chapter of their lives when they graduate from high school, and few will enjoy the achievement more than the students at the Spectrum Learning Center in Vancouver. It's a unique and, as you're about to see, a very effective program for people who struggle in conventional schools. Jeff Hastings reports. You want to do the Cold War ones, so the highlights of the Cold War? Vancouver's Spectrum Learning Center welcomes a full range of students with one thing in common. Before they came here, the majority were at risk of not graduating. For many reasons. They could be not attending school, they could have uh, problems at home, they may have personal problems, they may be out of the house completely. Many reasons. They may be in transition, they may be moving all the time. Grade 12 students Ashley, Robert, and Simone are about to cross the stage and receive their Dogwood diplomas, an outcome all three will tell you they didn't expect while attending mainstream schools. Well, I tell you to come here as fast as you can. Because <laughs> like, I felt like when I was in mainstream school and stuff, I wasn't getting the help I needed. Like it was more like, those classrooms have a lot more students in them. I expected um, Spectrum to be just like an average normal school, but I was just, um, surprise on how friendly all the teachers were. That friendliness, the personal family mentality emphasized at Spectrum is being credited for a spike in perhaps the most important measure of success. The graduation rate has tripled and almost overnight. Before significant changes were made to the program, they averaged 16 grads a year. Last year saw 42, this year there will be 50. It was really hard for me to concentrate on everyone and like actually come to school and like do my work and stuff like that because I felt like no one was really like no one really knows how I feel no one like you know what I mean we're gonna make sure that the curriculum the students are offered is not uh, a soft curriculum um, what we've tried to do is offer a wide variety of courses for the students uh, there's Spanish uh, is offered here uh, this year they're offering physics the number of students hasn't changed nor have their needs the difference is a change in location and curriculum they have their own building now, while putting a greater emphasis on career counseling and personal interaction, and challenging kids who perhaps haven't discovered how capable they are. If the program that the students are in is challenged, they're going to feel uh, as though the expectations are high. The teachers here keep the expectations high, and students will always shoot for the expectations. There's a sense of um, accountability, and there's a sense of uh, community, and a sense of uh, taking care of each other. Spectrum hasn't grown in a decade. Typically about 85 students in grades 10 to 12. There are no plans to expand. Jeff Hastings. Congratulations to Spectrum and those kids too. Nice to see they're doing well and flourishing.